Are you hungry? Guys, we're over at Fleur de Lis. We're gonna try this little, they told me it's got a rib, like a rib pie. Let's have a look. We can have a look here, this is if you want to try it out. Well, I'll try this one if you don't mind then, this rib pie. We've got pastizis. Bro, Oil, my please. We can have uh, all Chinese as well. That's no different, yeah. Or Ilma, please, as well. Ilma. Yes, it's you take it from me? Okay. Ilma, no money. All right. All right, thank you. Okay, thank you. Have a good day here. There you go, we're in this main road. This goes, uh, this goes down to Bikakara. Very busy road. Uh, how would you pronounce that? Snadza. Nice small shop. You can buy hot dogs and burgers. And uh, that's the road that goes to Bikakara, up to Fleur de Lis. Jaita. Well, I'm in his way. I'm in front of the church. Well, there's no parking around here. Point of parking point to the chapel. Walk down, guys, from uh, Silas Street from the takeaway. This is the garden of the station. Maybe we find somewhere here to uh, to eat. This is Brickacara Old Station. Um, there's a fountain up here somewhere. So maybe, maybe that would be a good place to find to sit down. You can see beautiful trees around here. This is where the railway tracks. This is the widest part of uh, Malta. My mask is coming in, so it's quiet anyway. Um, this is the widest part where there was two rails, where the train used to cross. Oh, can't breathe with these things on. Here's the station here. There was two trails here. The only part of Malta, there was two rails and the train used to cross we're gonna have a uh, steak rib pie let's find a nice place to sit down well there's a fountain here look the old church of Brikakara at the back here's the station okay let's go and sit over there looks like there's a nice bench in somewhere and sit near the water how romantic Mm. Made it guys. I walked down the Sailor Street. I bought that steak pie in the end. Let me see if I can put the camera a bit decent. Oh. Uh. Here's the old railway station from Bikakara. Let me get into the view of it. <laughs> This is the park of the Brikakara station. The tracks are just, uh, I couldn't stop anywhere up there. Traffic is horrendous. Uh, parking is unbelievable. Psyla Street, which runs all the way down into Brikakara. I bought this steak rib pie. <laughs> Something different there. Eh? We're gonna get inside. Look at that, yummy. Steak rib pie. Oh wow. 
Got some sauce in as well. Like a barbecue sauce. I bought the water and I forgot how much it was. I put it below. Got onions I think as well. Really yummy. It's like a burger I think, something like that. That shop is, um, I had it some time ago from that shop. He does like a bit of Chinese food in the evening. He does burgers and hot dogs and things like that. So if you didn't fancy like traditional pastizzi, something different. Many people take the shortcut through the park, go the other side. Look at a minute, I'll walk around and show you the coach. It's the only train coach in Malta. Uh, as you know, we used to have um, a railway in Malta. This was the station here. Lovely fountain. <coughs> the garden is nice. It was, it was uh, refurbished some time ago. It was left to uh, a lot of druggies was here. Left to really run down a lot. And now they've tidied it up and done the trees and trimmed the trees and tidied the station. The station was really left to run, out, run down. Now it's got, uh, you can go and join them if you want. There's an organization, railway motor or something like that. And they try and to get the tracks going, trying to sort out the tunnels. I'll leave you a link when I did the video here. This is really good. Very meaty. Lovely pastry. Like a puff pastry. With a bit of sauce. Really, it's like a, a bit of a burger. I tried to stay there in front of the church. <laughs> he came rushing out with his visor. I'm praying, I said. <laughs> it was really good. Rib, pie. <coughs> uh, I didn't catch the name because this, um, you see it, I'll put it up anyway. Sila Street, Rikakara. We walk down to the station here. This is better than a burger though. It's because it's got um, a bit of onion in the taste as well. Barbecue sauce. Lovely, lovely pastry. Look at the pastry, guys. Really, I was doing what I can find, what street food I can find, not just the traditional pastizzi and uh, Asa tarts, uh, Brussels fawn, and, um, and the Mortis ones. What else you can find? Street food. Now it's getting more and more. Even the flavours of the pastizzi, they're trying, experimenting a bit more. That's life, eh? We try everything. Thanks, guys. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, rib steak, rib pie. It's not a real steak steak. It's like a more like a burger steak. But very, very tasty. I like the sauce. The sauce is like a bit of uh, barbecue sauce at the bottom. Not too much. And I'm not sure what's at the top here. It's like, it's either onion. Oh, it might be some cheese up the top here. Look, it's got some cheese. Uh, maybe that's the... Cheese is a bit caramelized, so you're getting that oniony taste. Oh, there is onion as well. Onion, cheese, and that rib. Not really a rib. <laughs> Bye, guys. Take care. Hope you enjoyed it. More to street food. We're in Brickacar uh, Station here. Let's go and have a quick look at the the coach for you. I think they're not allowing you in, though. I can go down. This is the old railway coach. This is where the rails came. In fact, they look like they're trying to do something. Here's the station here. Ooh, too much reflection there to show you exactly. But I, <coughs> I have a video of it. Okay, guys, thank you. More to street food, take care. Don't forget to subscribe and uh, thumbs up and share. See you guys, take care. I'll show you all the signs 
So please subscribe to my channel And give me lots of likes